Now let's work on that repeating part that I've mentioned in a previous video of user factory create. It is repeating in our products test multiple times. So in each test we create a user and then acting as that user we get the products and assert what happens. What if we extract that into somewhere? And I will show you two ways. First way is a general PHP way and the second way is setting up the test with PHP unit and Laravel testing logic. So first, why don't we just extract this repeating behavior into some kind of method and I will use PHP storm for that. You can do it manually. So for example, PHP storm allows to refactor and then extract method. So it creates a method and then I can edit the name of the method, which would be create user for me. PHP storm detected other two places where that is used. So I click yes to refactor, replace all. So instead of that user factory, we have create user and let's edit that even more to have this as a private function because it is used only in that code. And also let's skip that variable and again use PHP storm to have inline variable. Return user factory create, great. And instead of mixed, we return user model. And now everywhere we have this create user and then acting that user. So this is already a bit shorter and we replace the repeating part with a method. But the code didn't get much shorter and this is probably more beneficial if you have more logic like a few lines of code which would be related to the same user and then private method is a way to go. But even better goal would be to skip that altogether in each method and have some kind of constructor to do that for us. And in test in PHP unit, so-called constructor is performed by a typical method called set up protected function set up, which would automatically call the parent setup from PHP unit. So we remove that to do. And then after parent setup, we do whatever we want. For example, we can call this create user, but then what do we assign that user to? And we have user create user. And then how do we use that in other methods in acting as? So let's define a private property, private user model user like this. And we assign create user to this user. And then everywhere in all the methods, instead of calling this, we will do just acting as this user like this, then like this here. And we don't need that line anymore. And third test, same thing, acting as this user which would be created automatically in the setup of the test. Let's rerun our PHP artisan test and make sure it still works. It's still green, nothing really broken. So generally setup method is for setting up any global variables or global settings for all the methods inside of your test case. Just don't forget to call parent setup before you do your custom things.